Our second dive today took us to a completely new experience for me. This was our first wall dive and the reef starts at about 7-8 meters and then there's just this sheer drop down into the abyss. Kind of gives you a bit of a fright. It's very dark down here. And it's animals and plants like this that really draw you down to these depths. Big sea fans, lovely big gorgonians that you find here. Lots of turbinate corals as well that you find on all the little ledges here. And what happened the week before we got here was that there's a huge tropical storm that passed between the Philippine Islands and Palau or Micronesia and apparently a lot of rain and some very big winds and they say that it's, it's really churned up the sea and made visibility a bit bad but for us as you can see this visibility looks pretty good so if this is the worst it gets we're gonna have a great month ahead of us here in Palau. These big fans are all very intricate and very delicate systems. They have pretty much like a man's hand. Um, lots of veins feeding out to the branches where obviously they, they catch all the nutrients from. And a very intricate and very structured root system that anchors them firmly to these rocky ledges. And then as we started ascending, we started finding some different animals like these little feather stars. The reef will be fairly sort of barren of them and then all of a sudden you'll find a little outcrop with maybe five or six that have colonized each little rock. Possibly the best vantage point for capturing passing plankton and food. Then quite an aggressive fish we came across. This is the Titan triggerfish. And they're extremely territorial and very aggressive. So I was trying to keep my distance and if you get a bit close, they will actually attack you or try and bite you and push you away from their nests. So we kind of left him alone and carried on up, up the reef. And again, on the top of the plateau, lots of fleshy corals, soft corals, but not much in the way of color. Some really nice structure though, nice sort of outcrops, big coral heads. Lots of the mushroom corals that you find here as well. Then a very familiar face came out between these little outcrops. One that we get back home in Sedwana Bay. This is the map puffer fish. So a nice dive and a new experience for me. And uh, I'm sure there are going to be a lot more of these great dives and challenges ahead of us.